Hey, how's everybody doing on a Sunday evening? Well, I hope everybody's doing pretty good. And in case anybody hasn't noticed or seen the news, our good old president went for a little joyride. So, one has to ask themselves, okay, how many people do you know that came down with COVID-19 and went out for a joy ride out of the hospital, but they weren't in a pine box. Just saying, people. Some of this stuff just doesn't make any sense to me. Now, I'll tell you what does make sense to me, okay? Let's put two and two together and see if we all come up with four. I'm sure there's some of you that are gonna come up with three or five. Suppose that we get COVID-19. Okay. He announced it early Friday morning, about 1 a.m., put it on Twitter. Now, you know, that's his main uh, uh, source, as you would say, as he likes to communicate with us American public. Or if you want to call us the peasants. So, all right. He waits till after the stock market closes. Now, hear me out here. We wait till after the stock market closes before we're taken to Walter Reed Medical Center. Of course, they fly him over there. You know, he was so sick, you know, couldn't do the drive. It's a 20 minute ride. Got, got to get the chopper. Got to make it look good. Oh, and put a mask on. Wow, did you believe that one? Don't know what the hell's going on there. Does anybody else out there see any problems with any of this? Or is it just one of those whew, moments? I don't know. But I'll tell you what is going on. It's a photo op. So he goes out, goes for a joyride. So he can drive by his supporters that have been camping outside the Walter Reed Medical Center and wave at him. Hi. Hi. I got my mask on. Hi. How are you guys doing? Meanwhile, if he actually has the COVID-19, everybody that is being put around him in the car, uh, anywhere, is being subjected to this. Whether they're wearing masks or they're not wearing masks, you know, if the dude's got this shit, what the hell's he out doing a fucking joyride for? Excuse my language. But I'm sorry, this just kind of ticks me off. And it should take a tick off a lot of American people. You know, look at the 209,000 people that have died. You know, we've had what? How many hundreds of thousands of cases and everything else? And this guy gets it, supposedly, which I don't believe. And now all of a sudden he's out for a joyride? Come on. Come on, people. Read between the lines what's going on here. This is getting to be nothing but a shit show. Really? I don't know, people. Make your vote count. That's about all I can say. Because what's going on here? It's like a three ring circus. Anybody out there remember the three stooges? Well, there's Curly. Till next time. I'm sorry, I just had to put a video out here. If you like it, fine. If you don't, I'm sorry. But it just doesn't make any sense to me how the President of the United States that had to be flown from the White House to Walter Reed Medical Center and has COVID-19 is out riding around in his stretched black yeah you know, ah, I tell you until next time hopefully one of these days we actually get some really good news to talk about. Maybe when this thing is actually over. But compared to anything else, who knows? Survival preparedness for beginners. Catch you all on the flip side.